Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I have a Sephora Play unboxing for you guys. Sephora Play is a monthly subscription of $10. You get five sample size products plus one extra item. Now if you go to the community section tab uh, of my page, I did put up a poll. If you guys want me to continue doing Sephora Play, or maybe I should invest into BoxyCharm. Now Sephora Play, um, for the most part, has been good boxes. Every once in a while I start getting repeats, and so that makes it kind of a bummer. So I would love for you guys to go vote on that. Let me know how you feel, what you're thinking. Um, but I think I'm going to go ahead and open this box up and we'll see how I feel about it. <laughs> so with that being said, um, really fast before we get started, if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that button down below. I would love to have you. Uh, you can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter, and I'm going to have those all linked down below for you as well. So let's open up the month of October. Yes. Okay. So inside the box it says show off and share using hashtag Sephora Play. Now this little pamphlet right here, uh, this comes in every single box and it usually tells you the theme of the month and everything on the back that you get in your box. It also lists how to use the product in case you are not aware of how to do that. Um, now this is different. Okay, so normally they give you um, a coupon for like 50 extra points um, once you make your next purchase. Uh, this one's a little bit different. This one says 20% uh, off um, October 15th through November 30th. Any foundation, tinted moisturizer, BB, or CC cream purchase. Okay. That is awesome. I definitely will be um, taking advantage of this. <laughs> yes. So I'm actually kind of excited about that. So that's a 20% off coupon that I get to use. Love that because um, they only do the 20% off like twice a year and that's usually the best time to buy products. But now I can go through and see if there's a new foundation I want to try or if something I need to stock up on, I can use that coupon. So the theme this month is Joy of Complexion. It says a drop of this, a dash of that. We're whipping up a recipe for the coverage you crave. Now I'm not gonna look at the back because I don't wanna see what is in my box. I like to be surprised. And uh, yeah, Ooh. So let's see, open this. We have a blue box this month. I know they've been changing it up a little bit. Uh, we've gotten green, we've gotten yellow, I think we've gotten orange. Of course the original um, black, white, red, uh, and blue. So, ooh, goodies. Let's see what we got. The first item we have, <laughs> I love this item, so I'm not mad that this is in here. I think I received it before, um, but this is an item I will use every day. So, this is the Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. <sighs> Urban Decay is one of my favorite setting sprays, so... I love that this is in here because I think I only have half a bottle of my other one left so for something like this it just you know I don't have to rush out and buy a full-size bottle so I'm okay with it it won't come out <laughs> so let's see this is the little sample size right here pretty decent I definitely can get a, um, a good use out of it so happy with this. Another item we have, let's see, what is this? This is the Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin. Okay, um, this is foundation. I want to say I have, I do have a Makeup Forever foundation. Hold on. Okay, so I have the Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation. Um, I actually, I, I need to get rid of this because it's no good anymore. But I love this foundation like this is a great foundation especially for summertime um and this is actually my summer shade so this is y245 um now this is a the same brand but a different formula this, so this is the matte velvet skin that's ultra hd so i have not tried this before so this is really exciting it says it's in the shade 240 y245 as well so that would be my summer shade so this is a little sample right here um, not saying I go through that in one 
you know, application, but it is smaller than I was expecting. Um, so hopefully I can get a couple uses out of here and see how I like it. It says it's a full coverage foundation, and I do like medium to full coverage, so I'm happy that this is in here as well. Another item we have, ooh, okay. This is the Smashbox Photo Finish Smooth and Blur Primer. I think I've only tried this once, but I don't remember how I liked it um, because I, I really do stick to the, um, the Touch and Soul uh, No Problem Primer and the Benefit Professional Face Primer. Um, but this smooths and blurs as well, so I'm definitely excited to give this another try and remind myself if I like this or not. Um, do you guys even use this? Do you guys use a primer? I'd love to know. If you do use a primer, which one is your favorite? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Okay, so I got three items left. This next item is, this is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Water Foundation. Wait a minute, wait, okay. Hold on. <laughs> I got, now I just pulled one foundation out, so now I have two foundations. That's kind of odd to get that many foundations in one box, but um, I guess that fi that fits with the theme, right? What was the theme? <clears throat> Joy of complexion. Okay, so I guess they are um, foundation based this month. Uh, now, I actually have purchased and tried this before. I have never received it as a sample. Um, this is one of my very first liquid foundations that I ever tried. And um, I do remember enjoying it. I can't remember why I stopped using it. I think it's because I started testing out other foundations because I was excited to venture in that whole area. Um, so, let's see how big this one is. This is in the shade 22N, light neutral. I can use light neutral sometimes. Um, we'll just have to see. So this is the little foundation bottle right here. It's a cute little bottle. I can tell that it has a dropper on it. I don't know how the shade is gonna work. Yeah, it might. I might be able to work that out. So that's exciting. I mean, like I said, I've only purchased this one time. I don't remember how I feel about it, so I'm excited to have this back in here and I can test this out again. Maybe I need to purchase another full size. Okay, the next item we have, if I can get it out, is a night body serum, firm and smooth, Moroccan body oil. Okay, <laughs> that is definitely interesting. I don't know if I would personally pick something like this out. So this definitely gives me out of my comfort zone. Um, it says it's a night body serum. Experience it. Apply a thin layer over body before bedtime. Massage in an upward sweeping motion to help stimulate blood flow. Focus on areas of the body that could benefit from a more youthful appearance, including the degligé. Interesting. Okay. It says this highly concentrated formula helps strengthen and protect the skin against environmental stressors. An antioxidant rich blend of argan and tasbaki oil. I don't know what that is. Um, intensely nourish. After only one week of use, 8 out of 10 women noticed firmer and smoother skin. An independent consumer study on women ages 21 to 40. So this is the sample size right here. Um, of course, the bottle is not completely full. It goes to about there, which I don't know why they would at, would at least fill it until right there, but that's okay. I mean, it's oil, so oil would go a very long way. Um, <laughs> I don't know if I... I mean, I want to try it, but I'm, I'm also scared to try it because, like, if it's all sticky or I don't like the smell of it or something like that, I would definitely have to wash it off, um, which, I mean, isn't a big deal. I can do that, but this is interesting. This definitely pushes me out of my comfort zone, and I'm, I'm kind of excited for it. So that is cool. And the last item we have is from Beauty Blender. So I guess this is their liquid whip long wear foundation um and this is just okay <laughs> i'm hoping that this is the extra one two three four five i'm thinking that this is the extra sample because there's quite a bit of product in here so i, I 
I would think that this is the extra instead of a perfume because sometimes we get perfume, we get um, shampoo and conditioner, which those are great and they usually come like in packages like this for the shampoo and the conditioner. So I'm assuming that this would be in place of that. Um, I actually have not tried this foundation. I don't even know how to use that. That's just so odd. Um, <laughs> but I mean, I'm willing to give it a try. You definitely will see me try it in the future. What shade is this? Okay, so I guess this is shade 2.10. Um, looking at this face chart, oh, well, not face chart. <laughs> looking at this little chart right here with all the different shades, um, I probably would have chose, hmm, that's a hard one. I mean, you can't tell just by colors on paper, but maybe the next one up. I don't know. Directions. Flip open cap and push down to release formula. Bounce damp beauty blender directly onto the surface and then apply to skin. Build and blend coverage as desired. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm still happy I get to try it out because it's a foundation I have actually heard good things about. So that's super exciting for me. Um, but yeah, I think that's the bonus this month. Let's see. No, I'm wrong. <laughs> okay, so um, of course our five items are the Smashbox, the Tarte. Um, it says the Beauty Blender is one of the items. Whatever. Um, <laughs> Makeup Forever Foundation, the All Nighter Setting Spray. It says the Moroccan Oil was the um, was the bonus. I thought that was one of the full size uh, samples. <laughs> So that's crazy. All right. I know I just read them through, but let's go back over it really fast and then I'll tell you guys what I thought. Okay. okay so we have the Tarte Reinforce of the Sea Foundation. Like I said, this is my very first foundation uh, purchase. Um, so I'm really excited to try this again, see if they got the shade right and see how I like the formula now. Uh, we have the Mouse Beauty Blender Foundation, which is kind of a really interesting um, sample. It, it seems the way it's designed that it's only a one-time use sample. I don't know if I could close that back once I open it. Um, but, <laughs> but I'm still excited to try it because it's a foundation I've never tried before. We have the Smashbox Photo Finish uh, Smooth and Blur Primer. Uh, this is the type of primer I would definitely use, so I'm interested to try this and see how I like it. We have the Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin Foundation. I love their Ultra HD foundation, so I'm really excited to try this formula out. They did get my shade right. It's just my summertime shade. I've already started to fade a little bit, <laughs> so we'll see how that works out for me. Uh, we, of course, for the bonus, we have the oil, which I thought was one of the actual samples um, because it is a pretty decent size for being an oil. So super excited for that one. Um, and of course, the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, which is my all time favorite setting spray. So really excited that this is in here. All in all, I mean, <laughs> they are really focused on foundation. Like I, I kind of got it once I got the two, but I got three foundations three foundations to try out. So that's really cool, especially because I was on a little foundation kick. So that that, that fits right in. <laughs> so all in all, I actually really like this box this month. I think this is totally worth my $10. Um, this definitely makes it harder to choose whether I want to cancel and switch to BoxyCharm or not. So I really, really want your guys' opinion. Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, you can guys can go and vote on the poll that I have on my page. Um, yeah, because this is a hard decision because it's boxes like this where it's like, oh, stuff I get to try and test and I'm excited for, um, and then BoxyCharm, which I get Ipsy and it's like BoxyCharm, but I've always loved my Ipsy. It's just, just let me know. <laughs> All right, guys, so that is it for this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give me a big ol' thumbs up before you go and I'll see you next time. Bye.